Hello YouTube, this is a sneak peek of my new upcoming product which I call at the moment OLEDI track but it might change, I don't know yet this is basically an Arduino slash ESP device with a micro SD card reader, rotor encoder it has different sensors, it has a GPS which is this little guy here including its antenna it will have a speaker 3.5 millimeter audio jack USB connector recessed for my USB magnetic cables that I like to use and uh, it will have a 1.3 inch OLED display 800 milliamp LiPo battery it will have onboard USB, onboard USB charger, of course, I mean LiPo charger. And it will have uh, LEDs recessed in the mounting holes of the OLED display. And what else? Yes, this is the hardware. The clue will be that it has a custom bootloader with which you can, when you turn the device on, and push a button it will load a menu that you can choose with the or use with the rotor encoder select the code that you want and upload that code to the device so you can have many 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 different codes on the micro SD card and then upload the code you want to use or if you don't do anything and you just turn it on it will upload the last code that was on there on the Atmega chip so you can have with this it's uh, it could be GPS clock whatever you like and I will include all my products or files that will work with this with the unit it also has a NeoPixel stick that will be able to use uh, you can use it as a flashlight or my police light code anything you can imagine it will have a RTC module of course too with the backup battery uh, it will be a, a CR 1220 this is a 927 so it will be a little bigger than that it will also have most likely the MSG EQ7 chip so it can be used as a spectrum analyzer the jack will be also be able to be used as an input so you can use my uh, OLED scope app with this so actually the sky is the limit uh, this accelerometer sensor has also a feature which is which can detect tap double tap and free fall so I hope to get this thing going too as to you can have it sitting there and when you tap it it will turn on this display and show whatever your app is doing. Of course with the ESP module it's, it will be wireless also so you can do anything that an ESP module can do with this also. And if you like to get a free one I actually do need a little help with the code. I have a custom bootloader on this which is working perfect which lets you decide if you want to load the code that's already on there or upload a new sketch and for that I actually have all three applications or all three codes I just need to get to put them together. The first one is of course the OLED uh, menu screen which will be used with the rotor encoder the second code is a list of the files on the SD card and the third is the loader app that you use to upload that uses the code to upload the chosen sketch so if you're good in programming and want to help me out let me know leave a post in the comment or get in touch with me directly and uh, yes I guess that was it for now oh uh, by the way this will be made with three PCBs you have this one main PCB this is the back side of it you will have a top and you will have a bottom PCB 
and do not worry I will not put my name on here on the front I will put it in the back so if anybody is scared that my name will be on there in the front because I actually don't like it neither to have somebody's name in the front of it anyhow uh, if you have any other suggestions for the name let me know and if you have any other ideas or suggestions I'm open I'm also open to critique if you don't like it tell me maybe I change something or find a better solution for it and uh, I guess this was it so anyhow if you're interested in helping me out and getting a free device for it let me know thanks for watching and take care YouTube